Welcome to another BTC Pay video. Today, we're gonna to spend Bitcoin using our cold card and BTC Pay. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to do an air-gapped transaction. This method is very secure, but more complicated than BTC Pay Server Vault. Check the video link below for more on Vault. Before we begin, make sure you have your cold card wallet file imported and your node is fully synced. First, we're gonna spend Bitcoin and create what's called a partially signed Bitcoin transaction. We're going to go to wallets on the left and click Bitcoin. Then in the top right, click send. Enter your destination address, amount, and fee rate you'd like to use. Below your destination address, there is a show coin selection icon. Click that if you'd like to see the UTXOs you'd like to spend from. Next, we'll click sign transaction to start the PSBT you'll automatically be taken to a new page to choose your signing method. For cold cards specifically, we're gonna choose select partially signed Bitcoin transaction. At the top under transaction details, you'll see the amount you're spending. Just below that under input index, you'll see a warning symbol until your transaction signed. Scroll past sign transaction for now and click export PSBT for signing. Click download PSBT file. This will be auto renamed to PSBT export. Keep this page open in your browser while you do the following steps. Go to your downloads folder or wherever you chose to save the PSBT. I like to rename mine so it's shown in cold card which one I'm signing. Now save that PSBT to a micro SD card we're going to go then put in our cold card. And once you're on the UI, select ready to sign. Cold card will recognize any unsigned PSBT on that micro SD and will ask you if you'd like to sign it. Follow the steps to sign the PBST, then reinsert the microSD back into the machine you're accessing BTC Pay Server. Return to the Transaction Details page and click the dropdown to Provide Updated PSBT. Choose File and locate your microSD with the PSBT and click Open. Next, click Decode PSBT and you'll notice the page change to confirm broadcasting this transaction. Finally, click Broadcast and your Bitcoin will be spent. You'll automatically be returned back to the wallet settings page with the transaction ID. Otherwise, you can see your recent transactions back in the main dashboard. Thank you for watching another BTC Pay video. Please reach out to us at our Mattermost for questions or check out our documentation for more information on signing a PSBT.